Hello and welcome to Making Joyful Noise from beautiful downtown Sarasota, Florida. We're at St. Paul Lutheran Church in Sarasota and my name is John Ferreira. I am the director of music and organist at the church. On Sunday, March 7th, we're going to be hearing a hymn sung as a solo. The name of the hymn is Canticle of the Turning which talks about the Magnificat. Now, the Magnificat is, of course, the Song of Mary. This particular arrangement was written, the music was written in the late 1600s, the early 1700s, again, about the time of Bach. And it was called, this is kind of cool, it was called Gilderoy from Pills. It's Irish. And the reason it was written is to purge melancholy. And when you'll hear it, you'll know why. The text for this was written back in 1952, which isn't really that long ago. But think about what was happening just in our country in 1952. And you'll understand some of the words a lot better, some of the relationships to the text. I'm going to play verse 4 for you right now. Use, and they're using an, an Irish accompaniment with Irish instruments. I think you'll enjoy it. You can see why it wipes away melancholy. That is a very, a very vibrant musical rendition of that. Uh, with one, of, one set of the words that really got to me this week was when uh, on, on verse four, one of the sentences, God's mercy must deliver us from the conqueror's crushing grasp. Now, some of us, I, I feel that some of us think about that as being war. I looked at it this week as because of everything that's happening, that the crushing grasp is the pandemic that we're in and God's word will deliver us. Thank you for listening. St. Paul Lutheran Church, making joyful noise. Tune on Facebook Sunday morning at 9.30. Thank you.